really blame him. This I can imagine being a tough matchup for Banjo and kind of no, being no, 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 no. much easier match. No, okay, it, it is Wi-Fi Banjo. Whatever's a tough matchup for Banjo is invalidated on Wi-Fi one and two. Whatever's a tough matchup for Banjo is not a tough matchup for his grenades. His grenade body. Yeah. And oh. And that is uh, why we picked Palutena in this match. This match depends. Yeah, most uh, Mega Man think this matchup is pretty horrible. I know King Arch is not a big fan of this matchup. Um, I know most at least consider it minus one. Many consider it minus two. Um, but yeah, Ray is off to a really good start at the beginning yeah, no, of this game. And he got a 52% combo. And you, you, we're used to seeing Palutena get 48%, which, make, which means Ray did some some special special stuff in his combo for an extra 4%. Yeah, that means and he's um, working with the juice. Ooh. Oh my god. This yeah, is and like, he cannot get back to stage right now. Oh my god. And you details. guys notice, Devin is, is quiet. He's not saying anything about his brawl bed. Oh, uh, damn, you just reminded me. Thank you very much. Yo, my man's out here. Paying no, off his loans. About to get three stars. <laughs> I'm not watching bit. at all. What? <laughs> yeah, he's definitely about like he, he is literally down a stock and three quarters. Oh, damn, yeah, yo. Worst Utopian worst. Ray is washing. Yeah, so... Um, Mega Man, Palutena, again, like, as I mentioned, a really tough matchup. Uh, Shield kind of invalidates pellets. Um, Nair kind of eats out all the Mega... Yeah, good night. Yeah. He definitely just threw. Um, that's a three stock by Ray. Um, he definitely that... left it falling in his coat pocket, for sure. Yeah, that, um, is a wash. We'll see if there could be any adaptation from Minty. But Utopian Ray looking really strong to start. I'm just and, saying, um, if you get washed that hard, my man's about to come out looking clean! <laughs> okay. Uh, so if I'm a betting man, I know that Minty actually does play a character other than Mega Man, and that is the uh, Game & Watch. So if I'm a betting man, I think that is exactly what we are going to see in this game number two. That is generally considered a better matchup, even though Palutena, I think, uh, at least pre-patch, definitely considered one both of those matchups. But Game & Watch obviously has things like the Out of Shield, things like the... Um, the combo game kind of to keep up with Palo in many ways. Right. Not to mention his uh, his field spell Wi-Fi is is currently active. Correct. And um, when the field spell is active, Game and Watch gets minus two reactability on all of his moves. So uh, <laughs> good luck. Oh no, he's saying Mega Man. Okay. Okay. Uh, Sage Switch comes out, but otherwise character staying the same. Utopian Ray. Staying with the Palutena that worked so well for him in game number one. And obviously, uh, maybe the FD counter pick kind of made Minty feel as though he couldn't really stop Ray from kind of jumping on top of him and putting on all that pressure. Yeah, but uh, I think uh, Stadium should help out with that, I think, quite a bit. Platform layout kind of helps Mega Man escape in uh, recovery situations and in uh, disadvantage in general. I mean, we've, we've already started this game off with this game two better than game one, but 2% on, on Ray didn't get zero to death already. Yeah. Um, ooh, big bear jumps over the castle thing though, so it doesn't take that damage back into neutral. Um, yeah, those uh pellets are getting eaten up by uh, they're, um, they're, they're getting munched. Yeah, that's shield, obviously, as I mentioned earlier, dash attack, but mostly back air, really effective against pellets. I wonder why people don't just like reflect the uh, I mean, I've I get the uh, reflector counter, whatever you want to call it, is kind of laggy. But, I mean, all Minty is doing right now is throwing projectiles at you. Something yeah. DK Will couldn't deal with, but Palestina definitely has the tools to. Yeah, I mean, she has the buttons uh, and the ground quickness to kind of get around the projectiles to begin with. Uh, right. Almost gets that detailed bit, uh, fair. They're going to get it anyway. Because and it's Mega, there, Man, yeah. Mega Man's been jumping after their upbeat. It's, it's yeah, just, that, it's a lot. A lot of Mega Man's do have that habit, and um, I know personally, as like a Wario player, you just kind of exploit that immediately with Bear Wa. Exactly. And, um, but with, with Ray, it's kind of the same thing. That big bear hitbox. Um, even Nair Fair is effective as well. Oh wow! Um, ooh! Oh, nice. he's running up to that's a stop. Wow. That is a punish and a half. Good recognition. It looked like he got me. away too. Did you see the, the hit stun animation? Wait, Ooh, no was job. I right? Wait, right oh. about what? After getting washed, he came back clean. 
Alright, get out of here. <laughs> get out of here, definitely. Um, but yeah, so, um, in this game number two, Minty looking a little bit more solid, still at quite the deficit, and obviously, um, neither of these characters really have the cheese, if you will, in terms of killing early. So, yeah, that's, this is, that's pretty true. Yeah, this is like the real, a real deficit in reality. Like, no card, like, Minty's not dying to anything yet, but, uh, he, ve he will very soon. And, Good um, move to top uh, his opponent off stage, by the way. Knew yeah. that he didn't have uh, true follow ups off of a down throw. Yeah. Oh, you're not just to the ledge, though, and that's going to be a stock at 100%. Yeah, that move lingers forever. Um, as Mega Man, that's kind of yeah. going to be your death sentence, even from below the ledge level. And, uh, I believe ooh. it's something stupid like 14 frames of. It's, I think it's 18, if I remember correctly. Oh, goodness. Yeah, it's crazy. Um, but Ray coming out strong. The stock up smash, though, on the landing. Catches That's him. actually a really smart up smash. Yeah. And I believe he locked him in shield with the uh, middle bait before going for that up here. Gonna get ooh. punished anyhow, though. Yeah, going for the um, up tilt there. Not looking out. Getting put right back to ledge. Back air, though. Really right, strong we'll base back on this Advantage. Oh, Ray gonna roll onto stage. That's actually something I, you see a lot from uh, the higher level players. When, it, when they're not pressured to roll, they'll roll anyway, because that's usually the option that they're not great. Yeah, right, because roll obviously, I mean, kind of Smash 4 conditioned us as it's the worst option, and many right. people are still in the mindset where it's like, yeah, roll is the worst option, so it's yeah. the one I'm gonna cover the least often, because good yeah, players exactly. should know that. It's usually one of those options you have to condition your opponent, but that's what, that's what makes it so good mm -hmm. at, the, at the start of games. Oh, wow, he just fares him before the explosive flame to come out, but he's still alive somehow at 120% or 134%. Ooh, almost covers that uh, up again, but the high FPs. Yeah, and that can be kind of tough as Mega Man sometimes. You do have confirms off Metal Blade. Oh! Back here. Detail back air. Detail's another move. Lingers a crazy long time. And it'll sit up very nicely on ledge. As long as you yeah, get that especially bar in. Yeah, recovery like Mega Man's, that's just gonna, Ooh. that's gonna scoop you every.